All right, gang. Uh, had a customer make a special request. They wanted a uh, bottle tree, and uh, I wasn't sure exactly what they were talking about when they mentioned it, but uh, I've done a little history lesson on it for myself, and uh, pretty interesting project. So uh, I figure I'll uh, try it. I bought. Uh, about a dozen sticks of half inch rebar. Uh, a couple of the people make them out of rebar. There's one lady builds stuff out of a uh, hot roll round. But most of them I've seen are rebar. I'm gonna see if I can get it to weld and stay together. And uh, we'll see how it goes. Y'all stay tuned. Okay, uh, first step is uh, I'll put a base down to tack to. I'm gonna take a uh, a piece of pipe <clears throat> stand it up in the center five pieces of half inch rebar will fit down inside here and that'll make i'm gonna make it a socket where you can take the top out or slide it in and then this piece will be hooked to the base this is not the base um probably cut this off at like six inches and then make my stubs where they fit down inside and then start a tree from there. What I do have the benefit of is directly over I have this piece of material that I used to hang whatever on. And uh, it's 90 inches to the bottom from my base. So uh, the tree's gonna end up being, you know, I don't know, eight foot, I don't know, something like that. We'll go from there. All right, so on the bottle tree, um, I got the first portion of it done. Is uh, I made a piece of pipe for a socket for the top section, all the branches fit into. And I know five pieces of the half inch rebar goes inside that. So let me let you take a look at what I have so far. Okay, so uh, instead of just running all the stems straight up and and they just be in a small tiny bundle i'm making them flex and curve and bend and uh using these little chain vice grip deals here to cinch them together i got my five stubs in i'm gonna tighten them up around the bottom put some tacks down there pull them together again somewhere else tack them together and then i cut my main stem main center stem is only eight feet tall. I cut the other stems at about a hundred. And uh, so that'll give me a little leeway to bend them out and do whatever. So, so far, this is where we're at. Get that sun out of your eyes. But uh, let me get that portion done and then we'll go from there.
Okay, I think I'm going to cut the tack loose up at the top so these can move around more freely. I may slide the base over some and get that uh, support rod out of the way. Uh, and then I can start heating and bending these these tree uh, trunk branches, the, uh, the trunk branch sections. See you in a minute. Okay, so I don't know if you can see it. But I've tacked it together here, several spots around, everywhere it touches. And I've used my torch and heated and bent and uh, give it a little bit of body to this trunk. And also by doing that, it creates a lot of little entrance points to put other tops in. I'm only, uh, only have five sticks of 10 foot long rebar and in it so far so i had i gotta cut and add some more i probably put that bend in a little premature but uh this is where we're at right now it looks kind of kind of spindly i don't know if you can see the background but uh, anyway making progress I have the tree done and uh, already painted, got it to a point. And uh, what I'm doing now, building a base to hold it. Use the same piece of pipe that I had to. Uh, that I stuck all the stems into to make the trunk. I figured I'd use use half inch round bar versus uh It's uh, very brittle. Figure these things will should hold.
thought process is to drive these tines down into the ground and then you slip the trunk in there and uh, they hold it steady. I think the trunk actually will protrude through the bottom of this cradle. resin on that pipe is a bunch of shit. That's the base. I'm going to take this base over and hammer it in the ground and uh, set the uh, tree in it. Stay tuned. All right, I got it. Hammered the base into the ground. Uh, my yard's on a bit of a slope. So anyway, there it is. That's how it's gonna hold up. I don't have a shit ton of balls to put on it. what we got. Clean that damn debris off. Fell over. Bottle tree in one good afternoon. Like, share, subscribe, comment. This is Mo Dammit. Tire Creek Island works out.